Hello! It's time for a very random stroll through various parts of the Bible. 16 assorted Bible trivia questions. First three are a warm-up, then we'll see. Let's begin. Question 1. Who found honey inside the body of a dead lion? Was that Jonah, Samson, David or Ruth? That was Samson in Judges chapter 14. Question 2. A man whose 10,000 talent debt was written off failed to forgive a debt of what? Was that 5,000 coins, 500 coins, 250 coins or 100 coins? And that was 100 coins in Matthew chapter 18. Question 3. Where was the boat headed for that Jonah boarded to run away from the Lord? Was that Tarshish, Tunis, Tarsia or Thyatira? And that was Tarshish, coming from Jonah chapter 1. Question 4. Some trust in chariots and some in what? But we will remember the name of the Lord our God. Is that horses, riches, runners, or kings? And according to Psalm 20, some trust in chariots and some in horses. Question 5. When the prophet Isaiah told King Hezekiah that God would add 15 years to his life, what did he say would be the sign given? Was it that the sun would not set for three extra hours that day? The sun would not set that day at all? There would be neither sun nor moon for 14 days. Or the shadow of the sun would return 10 degrees on the sundial. And that is that the shadow of the sun would return 10 degrees in Isaiah chapter 38. Question 6. The book of Judges tells the story of a man called Jephthah, whose only child ran out to meet him when he returned from battle. Why did he tear his clothes when he saw her? Was it because she was dressed like a harlot? She had been struck with leprosy while he was away. She had been raped in his absence? Or he had promised the Lord that whatever met him first at his return, he would sacrifice to the Lord. And he was sorrowful that he had to sacrifice his daughter to the Lord. In Judges chapter 11. Question 7. Who did Joseph tell his brothers had given treasure into their sacks? Was that God, Simeon, Joseph himself or Pharaoh? And he said that God had done it in Genesis chapter 43. Question 8. In the Sermon on the Mount, Jesus said, For where your treasure is, there will what be also? Is it the creditors, children waiting for an inheritance, the moths and the dust, or your heart? And where your treasure is, there will your heart be also. In Matthew chapter 6. Question 9. How many times does the scripture tell us that the Lord led the Israelites with a pillar of cloud by day and of fire by night? Is it once, twice, three times or four times? And that is four times. Twice in Exodus, once in Numbers chapter 14 and Nehemiah chapter 9. Question 10. The psalmist tells us that God maketh the clouds. What? Is it his chambers, his chariot, his pathway, or his promise? And God makes the clouds his chariot in Psalm 104. Question 11. Sennacherib's Assyrian army was almost totally destroyed by which of the following? 
Was it Hezekiah's army, the angel of the Lord, fire from heaven, or an earthquake? And that was the angel of the Lord in Second Kings chapter 19. Question 12. The sun stood still while Joshua's army destroyed what people? Was it the Amalekites, the Amorites, the Philistines, or the Hittites? And Joshua destroyed the Amorites in Joshua chapter 10. Question 13. Who owned the tomb in which Jesus was buried? Was that Mary Magdalene, Nicodemus, Joseph of Arimathea, or Simon of Cyrene? And Luke chapter 23 tells us that was Joseph of Arimathea. Question 14. Who is the only person in the Old Testament mentioned as being buried in a coffin? Is that David, Solomon, Daniel, or Joseph? And that was Joseph in Genesis chapter 50. Question 15. Who healed the man with the withered hand? Was that Peter, Paul, Jesus, or Stephen? And that was Jesus in Matthew chapter 12. And question 16. Who was the prophet that said to King David, Why did you despise the word of the Lord by doing what is evil in his eyes? Was that Samuel, Nathan, Obadiah, or Amos? And in 2 Samuel chapter 12, that was Nathan. So what did you get? 16? 17? Hope you found something to look up anyway. But until next time, goodbye and God bless.